Welcome guys to my wonderful closet, which you guys have seen several times. Today we are doing a different video. That's better. Welcome to my closet. Today we are doing something with these guys. You, probably, you guys don't know this, so I don't think I've ever said anything, but I'm kind of like a denim enthusiast. Yeah, I'm one of those people. I've been doing, wearing raw jeans, raw denim for like over a decade now, and honestly, I don't wash them. I never wash my jeans except for on rare occasion. And I just thought I would take you guys along with the journey. These guys, I was thinking, I, <laughs> uh, I was driving yesterday and I looked down and I saw a stain on them and normally I would just spot clean that. But then I just started thinking like, I don't remember the last time I cleaned these. So today's the day it's happening. And uh, you guys are gonna get to see how it's done. These guys I've been wearing for a couple of years. You can see there's a, Quite a decent amount of holes in them. The crotch is blown out a bunch of times. But these guys up here, I would say these are my longest standing jeans. I wore these out. I don't even remember the number of times that these jeans have been repaired. They're pretty much beyond repair at this point. But they're, see, this is actually came from the tailor. I actually haven't worn them since I got them back the last time. I'm pretty much afraid to wear them because they're about to fall apart. Anyway, these guys are the ones that are getting work done today. These jeans like looked like basically black when I bought them. By the way, this belt, shout out to this belt. This belt's freaking awesome. So I got this from a store called Ball and Buck in Boston. Really, really cool store. These jeans are a couple years, uh, I'd say like maybe like four or five years old. Washed them a few times maybe, and they're just getting there. They're, they're ready for a nice little wash, so let's go do it. You guys are gonna sit here for like two ish hours. This is all cold water, by the way, guys. You guys can already see, look at the water. Like, look at how you can see, especially over there, it's like already turning. Okay, so while that's going, I figured I'd take you guys along with me to the grocery store, which is fun because we got two hours to just chill anyway. Excuse me. Thanks. Uh, so, but I want to talk to you guys about a problem that is still happening with Trigger Devil. You guys know I already uploaded a video a couple days ago, like we were low on inventory. It's a problem. So, and you also know that I sent a replenishment inventory to Amazon. So it takes about seven days for that to process. So just processed like yesterday, okay? And I got an email that says, hey, look, your shipment's been processed. And I checked and, and the 50 that I, I only sent 50 because that's all we really could afford to send. Uh, obviously, because we still have to fill orders from our online, our own online store. So I, I kept a little reserve and I sent them everything else I had, which, which was 50. I'm like, great, we got a little repl replenishment that should get us by for a little while. I check it today, there's only 30 left. In a day, they sold more than 20 units. Like, that's a pace that we're really not prepared for right now. I mean, I, I did I did hash a deal out with my manufacturer. We have a second uh, order coming soon. But even once we get that, we have to we have to package them all. That takes a while. And then we got a, another seven day lead time to fill the Amazon store again. It's crazy. And then on top of all of this, guys, on top of all of this, we have another issue, which is I got wind that a YouTuber, a really, really well-respected YouTuber, is planning on posting a video on Trigger Devils pretty soon. And we have problems without that happening. And even if that, and so if that does happen, it'll stack. Now, I, I still want, obviously I'm, I want that to happen. It's great, it's good news, this is a good problem, but it's scary. It's scary to be running this low. I hope we get our inventory in the next day or two, and we should be able to just basically just squeak by for a little bit longer so it's very exciting times none of that is today's problem though today's problem is filthy jeans let's get back to that all of the groceries have been sorted let's go see what's going on with these jeans
them some dirty jeans. We got another hour and then we'll rinse these guys out. That is the final product. Look at how disgusting it is. <laughs> All right, let's rinse these things off. It is a couple of days later and look at these things they they're dried for the most part look at how vibrant all the lines and stuff and the blues are just so much bluer so that's all i got for you guys today i hope you enjoyed the video if you did drop a like as always you guys can leave me feedback for comments if you're new subscribe oh my god it's it, it's it's the morning right now so i'm pretty tired <laughs> my voice ah tantonio out